Finally, Luffy and crew arrive at Big Mom's island, Totland. There are some revelation about Big Mom's territory. Her territory called Totland and there are total 34 small islands in it. And they are handled by 34 Big Mom's chancellors. Also in Totland, every species from Earth lives freely. It's a free society to live for everyone. There are some mink also. Some long leg guys and some species we have never seen in One Piece until now. So in this arc, Oda will introduce all species is in one piece. Luffy and crew arrive at the chocolate town which is ruled by Chancellor Chocolate. On this island there are all things made of chocolates. Also one thing that you can eat that chocolate. These all chancellors could be the strongest members of Big Mom's crew. Luffy and all already meet the pudding but now they don't know who is the bride so pudding is kinda like a good girl and she also loves to cook so Sanji's and her bear will be great. She made the chocolate which Luffy and Chopper eat. She is also a good cook. By seeing all this we can say that Big Mom is a nice person but what is really going on here will be revealed in future. The biggest revelation of this chapter is Big Mom. It's we finally see her and she is the ugliest person in whole one thing. I can bet on this. She is cruel also she kills people for ingredients and stuff of cooking. In this panel you can see that there are three people who acquire fruits, flour and eggs for cake respectively. But to get that they fight with some people and you can see here some people are laying down. I think she is a cannibal and all around her also. But they don't look like a species because tree, sun and lots of things are there which are talking it could be a big mom's devil fruit ability. I will make another video to explain her ability. Also she already knew that Luffy arrived on the island. By seeing her face we can already say that she is planning something and it's about Luffy. She already waiting for him to come and also she is vigorous to meet him. It could be possible that all this wedding and stuff is only for to lure Luffy on her island. She wants something from him. What could that be we will found in future. Also one mink was there who called Pedro captain. It could be possible that Pedro was pirate before. He will tell everything later. But this topic is quite suspicious. It could be possible that before leaving piracy Pedro was aligned with Big Mom. It's just my thought. I will made a video on this. There are a lot of theories about Pedro being the big Mom's subordinate and he is a traitor of Zhao. It could be possible or it could not be possible that we will see in the future. After reading this chapter, there are a lot of questions rise. First, why Pedro lose piracy? Second, why Big Mom arranged tea party? Third, is she really waiting to meet Luffy? Or fourth, how she knows that Luffy arrived on her island? There could be a someone traitor who told Big Mom that Luffy is around or it could be possible that Sanji's brother and sister told her but Sanji's brother and sister already said that forget about this meeting who told Big Mom about Luffy's arrival this could be tell in the near future chapters so guys this all question will be answered in future chapters until then take care subscribe to damn fame for more one piece video it will be great for me and as always I will see you in the next one.